Welcome everybody to DXP Diecast Racing. Sitting outside before it gets too cold. Going to turn cold this weekend. Also got a uh, remnants of a tropical storm hurricane fixing to come up this way. So I thought I'd come outside just for a little bit before it gets nasty. Show you what we're going to race next. Probably seen some of these. Going to put five pack battle out. First one will be this one. The Hot Wheels Exposed Engines. I think some people have already ran this one. It's got the rig of mortar down here. It's got this bone shaker. Corvette gasser. It's Fiat. It's got this Chevrolet station wagon gasser up here too. These are the Exposed Engines. This one came out not too long ago from Hot Wheels. They're not really heavy. We're going to run them on the track just to see what happens. And we're going to put this five pack up against this horsepower five pack. This one has the nitro door slammer, has the charger, has this one right here. Now, this is the Ford Raptor. Now, of course, these being the off roading wheels and a little bit wider, that won't fit on the track. So, we're going to substitute him. Looks like you got a uh, 2.0 here of the, uh, what is that? I can't remember what you call that one. Roger Dodger 2.0. And then you got this pretty Corvette convertible up here, this blue Corvette. So what I figured we'd do is we'd run this five pack against the other, minus this truck. So in place of this truck, since it's a Ford, I got this one right here. 84 Mustang SVO. Now, this is from the M case right here. Might have seen me when I picked this one up. So I figured I'd replace the Raptor with this one. And we'll run these 10 cars off against each other and just see how they do. Stay tuned. All right. Got the five packs all dusted up, minus the truck. Got the Mustang to replace it. These are the groupings. But before we get to racing, I just want to say thank you to uh, all the subscribers. We broke over the 300 uh, subscriber mark. And uh, thank you for watching and wanting to see this content. Uh, hopefully you'll learn about some of these castings, the new ones and some of the old ones. And if you're a racer, some of the ones you want to race and try to find and some of the ones that you want to avoid. So, but anyway, this is just a good learning tool. It's a nice hobby. A bunch of good guys in this hobby. And uh, just thank you. Uh, if we get to maybe a 1,000 subscribers, we may do a big giveaway or something. Who knows? Um, but thank you very much for subscribing and uh, watching. And let's get to some racing here. It's a rainy day here in Tennessee. First rain we've had in a while. Let's do the Chevy Gasser here, the Nova Wagon, up against the 84 Mustang. Checked out the track. Track looks like it's in good shape. Actually ran a mod on it just a few minutes ago just to see how it would do. Looks like it's going to do just fine. Get this one over just a little bit so he's not dragging on the wall. So we got the Ford Mustang in lane one and the Nova Wagon in lane two. Battle the five packs, ready, set, go. Ooh, Mustang got him 2289 to a 2351. Mustang, whoops, Mustang right there. Got him by, do, 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 do. Good grief, almost a one and done right there. We're gonna run him back. Don't think he's going to catch up to that. A pretty good beat right there. Like the 60s. But we're going to run them again just because we can. These cars have all been dusted up. Worked a little bit. Ready, set, go. Got the hill, but not on the straight. Mustang going to take it 2281 to 2329. Mustang not bad. Mustang right there is going to take the first one. Oh, man. Oh, guesser. If 
funny thing about these uh, five packs, here we got the door slammer, the nitro door slammer right there. Pretty cool looking car. Man, really disappointed in this one right here. You talk about not much there. Plastic bottom, this right here, that's metal. There ain't much metal too. That feels like plastic too. Man, they've kind of, Hot Wheels. Come on, man, y'all can do a little bit better job. But Fiat right here used to have a good, strong, heavy metal base. Pretty fast running car, the old ones. But man, I don't have much hope for this thing at all. Ready, set, go. That's what I figured. Just really, really light car. 2281 to a 2357. Nitro door slammer. Right there, I kind of like that car. Pretty cool looking. This one, disappointed. I mean, it's got a cool paint job. I like the I like the blue with the gold flames and everything, but man, it's just, wow, we've really cheapened out a little bit. Ready, set, go. Oh yeah, all the way. 2287 to a 2370. Just, I mean, there's just nothing to it. Nothing to it. Nitro door slammer, moving on. Put that one over here. All right, we've got the 70 Challenger right here versus another one that's been cheapened out a little bit. The rig of mortar, rig of mortar right there. And lane two, I mean in lane one, charger in lane two. Ready, set, go. I mean, there's just, there's no weight to them at all. That's a one and done. 2288 to a 20, I ain't that one again. I mean, there's nothing to them. These things used to have a metal, metal bottom and everything, and there's just nothing to it. It doesn't matter. That pretty car right there won. All right. Let's get to the Corvettes. Got this blue one right here. What year is that? Let me look here. It's a 2019. Real pretty. Going against the old gas monkey. We're gonna put the old orange one over here in lane one and the blue one in lane two. Two Corvettes going at it. Got a big Corvette race coming up for blue line. Ready, set, go. Ooh, 2315 to a 2322. Finally, we got a race. <laughs> Phew. Seven thousandths. For the gas monkey. Yeah, I mean, it's hard sometimes finding these cars to just five packs. Man. I mean, and the thing about these five packs nowadays, you get like one or two cars that are really cool in it, and you get some that are just, why are you in there? 7,000 beat to the orange Corvette. Ready, set, go. Uh oh, the blue one got out on him. And the blue one's going to take it, 2296 to a 2314. So the blue one beating the old gas monkey. I mean, phew. All right, here we go. Roger Dodger 2.0, known to be fast. Bone Shaker, classic. Both of them in this kind of battleship gray type look here. I got my money on that Roger Dodger 2.0. Ready, set, go. There he goes. 2304 to a 2344. Got him by 40 thousandths. 40 thousandths beat right there. So, if you're looking for some of these five packs and you're wanting some really fast cars, hopefully this will help narrow your choices down. Ready, set, go. Get it all the way down too. 2300 to a 2338. 20 thousandths beat the first time and a 38 thousandths beat the second time. I mean, it's pretty cool looking. I always like those bone shakers. Just had that big bone shaker race. This is light, light, light. So here you go. Here are your ones right here. We will. Good grief. Did that. 
So none of that five pack, none of the five pack right there won. Whew. Okay, Mustang. Let's put him against, uh, let's go old and new. Let's do purple, just for the fun of it. The Charger in lane one. The Mustang from 1984 Fox Body Special right there. Lane two, ready, set, go. Look at that. Mustang got him 2262 to a 2275. Wow, Mustang's picking up some speed now. Got him by 13 thousandths. 13 thousandths for the O Stang right there. As I have learned to call that car a Mustang. Ready, set, go. Oh, did he get him that time? He did not. Got him by, got him by five, not enough. Mustang's gonna move on. Beats the old charger, that's a pretty charger though, if you like flames. Pretty cool, pretty cool, pretty cool. Let's do the Nitro Door Slammer versus this sucker right here. This is the Roger Dodger 2.0. And the Nitro Door Slammer. Ready, set, go. Well, that's a good race. Nitro Door Slammer came around him, though, at the end. 2276 to a 2294. Whew, that's a uh, four, four 18 thousandths. For the Nitro Door Slammer, right there. Don't have too many of these Nitro Door Slammers. I don't know how many of these things they made different versions but uh i don't think i've got too many of those ready set go oh roger dodger 2.0 came back on him only by 2000 so bigger beat goes to the nitro door slammer in the first race these are pretty fast little cars too right here all those that they've made the different ones Pretty cool looking. I like this one. This is pretty neat looking colors anyway. Corvette versus the Mustang. Mustang going over here in lane one. Corvette in lane two. Mustang's the only one not from a five pack. Ready, set, go. Man, he got him all the way down. 2274 to a 2305. Got him 26, 29 thousandths. Rain is starting to let up. That's good. It's raining hard this morning. It feels, still feels good out here. It's gonna drop. Temperatures are really supposed to drop here this weekend. Ready, set, go. Mustang got him again. Got him 2269 to a 2299. Got him by 30 that time. Pretty consistent. Mustang. Nice Corvette. Going over here. Here you go. These two guys right here going at it. Nitro door slammer. Mustang. Who is going to be the one to win? Mustang in lane one. Nitro door slammer in lane two. Ready, set, go. Oh, Nitro Door Slammer came around and got him by five thousandths. 22.72 to a 22.77. Five thousandths beat by the Nitro Door Slammer. He's trying to slam the door. Ha! Sorry, that was terrible. Terrible, terrible, terrible. Ready, set, go. Let's close the race. Mustang got him by two, but not enough. Biggest beat goes to the first round. The Nitro Door Slammer. Now, that's pretty cool. Not bad, not bad. Here, let's weigh him. Let's see what he can do. I don't know if y'all can see that. I held this weird last time when I watched the video back. You couldn't really see it. Hope you can see it now. 3589 is the weight. 3589. 
Oh, that puts you in this place. Oh, 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 uh-oh. The gatekeepers now, this FTE uh, Formula 8R, I believe what it is. I don't know, that used formulator or whatever you call it, if you want to say it all together real fast. FTE car, faster than ever, of course. Now, before we go on, before, let, let me just say something here. Faster than ever. There's nothing wrong with faster than ever, okay? Some of those are really fast, and some of them aren't. One, two, three, four in this bracket thing right here, this, this classification. Out of all the cars, and I've got quite a few of them, Faster than ever's are fast, or can be fast, they can be slow. Don't let the name fool you. Ready, set, go. 22.75 to a 22.86, got him by 11 thousandths. The Nitro Door Slammer, non-FTE. At least he got him in that lane. 11 thousandths, let's switch it up. Nitro door slammer, long wheelbase car. That always helps. Ready, set, go. You're gonna take him, gonna knock him out. 2277 to a 2288. Got him by 11. Nitro door slammer's in. This guy's been in the case for a long time. And you are now out. Let's move him up. There's a bi, is this a bifocal? I believe that's what that is right there. Bifocal, maybe it's a bifocal two, I can't remember. Put him over here in lane one. Door slammer in lane two. Let's see if he can move up the ranks. Ready, set, go. Oh, he got him, went right around him. 2275 to 2295, got him by 20 thousandths. Nitro door slammer. Trying to do some damage. Right here this morning. 20 thousandths beat. Ready, set, go. Oh, bifocal two came back. Not enough. Didn't win anyway. Still didn't win. 22.86 to a 22.93. All right, let's move you up. Let's see what you got here again. Let me put that one down here. What's this guy right here? This is also came from a five pack. Say like a mono post mono mono something mono racer mono racer. All right, mono racer. Nitro door slammer in lane one. Mono racer in lane two. These are my thirty-five gram and under cars. Ready, set. Go! And he got him all the way down the hill. 2281 to a 2300. Woo. Got him by 19,000s. We are going to swap them up. Mono Racer over here in lane one. Nitro Door Slammer in lane two. Ready, set, go! And he got him again. Most of these cars you find nowadays are going to be in this range. It's 20, 2271 to 2285 in this weight class. It's a very fun weight class. It does move a lot. At least it, mine does. Have a lot of them that uh, go against this FTE Audacious. Uh, mine seems to move quite a bit with the different castings. Uh, which is kind of cool, because that way you get the, the new ones get some little bit of love, and that's what you want. You want to give some of these new ones need a little love. Ready, set, go. Not gonna find too many uh too many nowadays that are gonna compete with like the Fairmonts and the, the Marauders. Got a five thousandths beat by the FTE. Audacious. Audacious, going to lane one. You're going to lane two. Ready, set, 
Go. Did you get him all the way? Got him all the way. Okay, so we got a stopper. Got a stopper. 2277 to a 2279. So he's not quite fast. Ooh, I saw something on this track. Sorry about that. A little piece of debris. Got the garage going here. I've had a lot of wind lately and uh, got some spiders all of a sudden decided to take residence. Put him up against this. Uh, is that a. What is this? This is a. I know it's a Lamborghini. It's obviously my number two. Uh. Centenario Roadster. There you go. Some of these cars I'll never see in my entire lifetime in real life. I can't imagine how much something like that would cost. Ready, set, go. And the Lamborghini got him by four thousandths. 2282 to a 2286. Pretty little Lamborghini. That was one of my cars I was testing for the lightweight. The uh, lightweight race over at Scale Racing Channel earlier this year. Got him by four. Ready, set, go. Oh, uh-oh. Did you get by more than four? Oh, got him by five. Look at that. 79 to an 84. Whoo, so he's a little bit faster. A little bit faster beat. All right. So you're in front of him. Salt shaker. This is the one that actually went over there. Not my fastest one, but he did actually go. So we're going to see if he's faster than this guy with these little skinny wheels. Ready, set, go. Oh, it does not look like it. 2269 to a 2281. Got him by 12 thousandths. See if he can do it in the other lane. 12 thousandths beat by the salt checker. Yeah, gonna do the recal. I was gonna start here next month with the recal. Ready, set, go. Oh yeah, he got him again. Okay. We know where he does. Ooh, that's closer. 2271 to a 2273. So we know where he's gonna be at which is good. Let's go ahead and do this. I want to thank everybody for watching. I'm going to try to do another video here in a little while while I'm home and uh, see if we can't uh, do a little bit more further testing. Nitro door slot is going to go right here. Uh, I want to give a shout out to a couple of guys. Extreme Diecast Racing. That's a good channel to watch right there. He ended up right there. That ain't bad at all. He fell out. I wonder if this guy right here, do you think he... I'll test him off camera just to see if he... Because he was pretty close. See if he can get in there too. Uh, ex, uh, extreme Diecast Racing. Uh, good guy here to uh, be watching on his big 40-foot track. He's got some good stuff going on. Elevation Diecast. Guy out there and you know, I believe he's in Colorado. I'm a certain awesome. He's got he's got a little bit of issue going on, but man, he's doing some awesome racing. Love the selection that he's throwing out there. Scale Racing Channel just missed a good one right there with Scale Racing Channel uh, with the Germans, German cars. Uh, got a lot of other good stuff coming up here. Another guy here, Kit Racing. Man, I forget about Kit every once in a while. I watch him all the time. Kit Racing's got some good stuff. Got some monster truck action going if you like that stuff. Some good, good stuff. The rain is stopping. We're going to do some testing out here. DXP Diecast Racing. Thanks, everyone, for watching. Uh, continue to watch some of these other channels. Mr. Mom's Racing. Uh, Red Pill Racing. Blue Line Racing. There's so many good channels out there. Uh, Commotion Diecast. I mean, there, there's just so much. Live Young Diecast, a lot of good racing out there. We'll see y'all on the track. Y'all take care. God bless each and every one of you. See ya.